Hi, for this recording, I'm going to show you how to convert the equation of a surface in rectangular form to cylindrical coordinates and spherical coordinates. The example I'm going to show you is to convert the equation of parabola right z equal to x squared plus y squared in cylindrical coordinates. First, let's try to understand the surface z equal to x squared by y squared first. Now, I've used Microsoft Mathematics add-in graph to sketch the surface, and this is how the surface will look like. Now, I'm going to convert this equation into cylindrical coordinates. Remember, the cylindrical coordinate consists of r, theta, and z. Now we are going to convert equation z equal x squared by y squared so that it only use r, theta, and z. Since we know x equal to r cosine theta, y equal to r sine theta, z is same. So let's do the conversion now. So z is still the same in Cartesian coordinate and cylindrical coordinate. Now x squared is r cosine theta square. y square is r sine theta square. So after you have square, the term get r square cosine square theta plus r square sine squared theta where r squared is a common term I have r squared times cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta from trigo sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta is equal to 1 so we can simplify this equation to z equal to r square times 1 or z equal to r square cylindrical coordinates how about converting z equal to x square plus y square in spherical coordinates now in the case of spherical coordinates the equation has only rho theta and phi where rho is the distance from the origin, theta is the angle measure from the exact plane, and phi is an angle measure downwards from the z-axis. And we also know the conversion formula, x equal to rho sine phi cosine theta, y equal to rho sine phi sine theta, z equal to rho cosine phi. So converting the equation now, I know z is rho cosine phi z is equal to x squared x squared is rho sine phi cosine theta square plus y squared y is rho sine phi sine theta square so now we simplify the right hand side there is a rho square, sine square, phi, cosine square theta, plus rho square, sine square, phi, sine square theta. And we know that the common term is rho square, sine square, phi, and then cosine square theta plus sine squared theta. As we know, cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta is 1. So, this simplifies to rho cosine phi equal to rho squared sine squared phi. After cancel the rho, I get cosine phi equal to rho sine squared phi or rho equal to 
cosine phi over sine squared phi. As we know that 1 over sine phi is cosecant phi. So this is cosecant squared phi in spherical coordinate.